So, um, back at it again today. Um, see, I do fully agree, you know, we should work with our walks with God at our own pace. It's the same thing having a job, like, I I don't know if everyone's going to agree with that or not, but I just believe that my Christianity, you know, working at God, doing what He wants me to do, working with Him at my own pace, just like any job I have, like, I drive, but I also cater, too. I like jobs that I can, like, do more freelance at, like, I can... I can kind of go and work at my own pace, basically. I don't have to have a boss over me all the time because I've had jobs in the past that I just literally cannot stand. Like, I cannot stand having a boss or someone over me all the time, just over me all the time, micromanaging, screaming, yelling, cussing like my old chef did back when I worked. uh, I used to work for, used to do a hotel job at the Hilton. I was a cook. I was a line cook there. Uh, worked a little bit in Chicago. I, I cooked there for a little bit. Like, I like to cook and everything. But I've I've worked other jobs in the past too, like warehouse jobs and everything. And those jobs where you just have a boss over you all the time. Like, I just. I mean, I understand if you need money and everything, but like other than that, if you're able to get out of those types of jobs and just do something else and try new things like that is what I prefer, like, job where I can be more freelance at, like, I don't have to have a boss over me all the time, screaming, yelling, cussing, all this stuff, like, so many bosses are like that, I just don't understand that, I don't, I don't prefer jobs like that at all, um, but, um, sorry, I'm at an intersection right now, I just don't, prefer jobs like that at all i like jobs where i'm able to work at my own pace um i guess certain jobs like i don't know if it's like like computer jobs or anything else you know like you could have more of a learning curve at where like where like if it's more like of a technical job like you like if it's more technical or something technical job that you have more of a learning curve back, but like I just prefer me myself like I know I have to take each day at a time with my walk with job with 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 God but like it's the same with I guess the same with a uh, a job basically it's like I'm having to work at my own pace which I like better than feeling like I'm pretty much like a robot basically I guess if that makes sense but like I, I'm basically like I just like I just like taking one day at a time with my Lord and Savior and working at my own pace with him. That's more of what I that I prefer to do instead of feeling like I'm having to get so stressed out like oh I'm not doing this right, I'm not doing this right. No, I'm just praying out to God, God. If I don't see something wrong in my life that I should be doing, and I don't see it, but maybe someone else sees it, point it out to me because I don't see, or like someone points something out, and they tell me about it, and I'm still not sure, like, I don't do that. Like, what are you talking about? I don't don't know what you're talking about. And if it's biblical, or if you're just not sure, then always be sure to pray about these things. Always. My uh, brother in Christ, Marcus, Marcus would always talk about, um, if you're unsure about it, you know, just go and pray about it. But it's all, it's, this is why it's always important to read the word. Like, whoever says reading the word, like, you shouldn't do that, like, is wrong. Like, oh, we don't have to read the word to know God. Well, it's important if you want to hear God speak, then yes, you should. You should be reading the word. How else are we supposed to hear God speak? So the word's there for a reason. Um, read your word. Uh, read the word to show yourself approved, basically. Show thyself approved, basically. 
but taking one day at a time, working your own pace with God, basically, like, man, like, just always acknowledging God, He's there, yes, but working at your own pace with God, because, I don't know, I, I, I would, I like that, because I don't want to feel like, get caught up in legal, that's what legalism, that's what I should have been saying, legalism gets you so caught up in every day, I'm not doing this right, I'm not doing this right, I should be doing this, this, and like, don't get caught up in legalism, like, acknowledge God, yes, read the word, fasting is always good, yes, I encourage fasting, now, is fasting a is fasting dampering on your salvation? I don't believe that, but like, we should fast, and especially like, you know, certain things that we have in our life, we should fast. But like, um, working each day at a time to draw closer and closer to the Lord, basically working at my own pace to draw closer and closer to the Lord with each day, basically. So, just acknowledge Him. Make sure you're acknowledging Him. You know? But, getting my car looked at today, so hopefully it gets fixed. I pray to God that my, uh, my uncle knows what he's done, which I'm sure he does, but I just got to get it looked at, so. Anyway, have a great day, and if you need prayers, I'll pray for you. Put it down in the comments, so God bless.